All right, all right. Look, again, I'm back, Nova. Uh, sitting on the same porch uh, in the same uh, position, probably. But I'm going to tell you what. I need to know, how come Franklin police do not... Um, uh, now, look, I've got many issues with them. Uh, my charges pressed against the hotel worker who walked in with the key and uh, had two days paid. Now, why would he do that? Because, you know, he wanted to uh, probably come in on my privacy. That's why. And, uh, you know, don't take a real dumbass or, or intelligent, brilliant person to figure that out. So, uh, now, he stole from me many things. And things of my son, even. And, uh, I mean, I'm talking about a lot of money, man. I'm talking about my purse with my cards in it and my money still in it. And plus the days of the hotel left. And and I'm not talking about nights in and uh, there in Dayton. I'm talking about right here in Franklin. No, Springboro. As soon as you get off the exit. Dude done robbed me of everything I had. And um, after I was taken to the jail and then to the mental ward because I was acting insane. Yes, I was. Of course I was. I got PTSD and some motherfucker walks in my room like that. You know, using this key. Knock! Knock! I, I don't have to tell too many motherfuckers at the hotel many times. Knock at the door. I will come and open it when I'm ready, when I'm dressed, okay? And then still, still. But my, my charges... I got to pay all these fines, okay? Number one issue, I got to pay all these fines. He is not even, I, my charges pressed aren't even, uh, I got to go do it again, apparently. Again, another thing, number two problem. Uh, uh, I done dropped some stuff against my own son. Franklin police, you know, Franklin, whatever. Uh, the whole damn system is kicked ass on me forever. Uh, I done dropped those charges. My son even called himself while we were out there on the road and said, yeah, uh, his brothers were not dropped, but mine were. I knew mine were because I dropped them. Now, I don't know what the hell is going on with that. They're picking on me, man. And I have the freedom of speech to say so. Now we got this different president in. It's going to be, you know, an ass wipe, I'd say. I don't know. I mean, I, I, I don't know the guy personally, but he's been in there for a while. What, not he do something a long time ago? Come on, man. Uh, this is not right. And I got to get the hell up out of here. Now that I'm ordained, I want to just go somewhere. I can't even see my own grandbaby. Is his name uh, the name on the blanket? You know what I'm saying? I, the picture there, um, my my grandbaby, uh, the new one, uh, I, 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 oh, God, he just looks just like my son, Dakota. Um, is that his name, the name on the blanket? Um, I don't even know. And that's not fair either, is it? And it's not fair that I didn't get to go see my son Dawson on Christmas because Kentucky uh, Children's Services said that I had to call them and check in first. This shit is not right, man. It's not right. And look at these people all in a hurry. You know, what's the hurry when when you don't have... When you, you hit my level right now, where... Do I get help with this? I, I can't help not one son, not one, let alone four. I can't even see my own green babies. And why are they telling me my charges ain't dropping? I can't drop them. How can I not drop them when I already did? It's not fair. And the system is screwed. It's so screwed. If you think you're not in trouble, man, you are, because now we don't even have Trump in, man, oh my god, we don't even have him in, so I don't know what's gonna happen now, uh, you know, I don't know, and I, I really, I just want to leave this country, because I don't have anybody that loves me here anyway, my mom's in the hospital, she loves me, I can't even go see her, <laughs> my mom's in the hospital, and I can't go see her. And you know, I'm always putting stuff about my mom on there. Um, I, I don't know exactly what's happening. I don't know. But I know that 
you know, it's not just me that stopped me from knowing. So, uh, you don't know what I'm saying by saying that, but I really don't want to even care anymore about Ohio, but I got all the people I love here, and then I get the one son traveling, and I, I don't, I swear, Rodney, I try, I try, I'm trying to drop those charges, I already did, and you know that, but then now I gotta do it again, and I can't even get them to pick up the one on the guy that you don't even know nothing about, it was after you, uh, I, and that was uh, their fault, because, I, but I'm not gonna go on and on about this, I, and I'm not on drugs. I'm going to tell you right now, son. You better quit talking about I'm on drugs to people. Because I'm not. I drink. I drink alcohol. You see that? You see that? That's what I do. And my cigarettes are even fake. Look. Now, I don't have to prove that to you. But I say it because I want to. Because I need to for me. So I need to let you know. I'm older. I'm not in that lost dilemma that you're still in so you need to stop talking shit about your mommy okay you know son and look at my new ring remember the ring i gave up of grandma's memo nova remember well this is hers too so i replaced it i love you anyway and i will always love you no matter what so please know that all of you all my sons know that please because <laughs> oh my god life is short and uh you know you think it's long while you're living it but it's not peace out